all right guys uh, this video tutorial is related to detecting the multivariate outliers by using the mahala nobel system method so what you have to do is after uh, detecting univariate outliers and deleting from the files you can see that in the serial number cell that the respondent number four is deleted because it was con it was detected as an outlier similarly respondent number eight and nine was also deleted from the file because of uh, because it was also appeared as a univariate outliers after this open the file again or save the file again or save the file and uh, after this you have to click on first click on analyze click on regression click on linear okay in the dependent variable you can place any of the item over here i'm just placing serial number in the dependent cell because right now we are not considering any dependent independent variable this is just a method to detect the univariate outliers so i just place serial number in the dependent cell and rest of the items in my independent variable click on save and then place a check on this mahala nobus then press continue and then press continue after this just minimize your output window you can see that in your data sheet that mahala nobus values are created in the sheet after this you have to click on transform click on compute here in the target variable i'm writing probability because i'm calculating probability the formula is one minus the numeric expression you have to write one minus click on all and after this you have to identify cdf dot chq from those functions and special values so i'm just pressing cdf okay here it is i just double clicked over here you can see that two question mark appeared in this in the first question mark you have to place the values of the mahala nobus distance so i'm just replacing this question mark from this value i just double clicked over here and in the second question marks you have to write the total number of the items of the questionnaire which means that if you have five variables and each variables have five items so it means that the total number of the items are 25 do not include the demographic variable demographic um, terms over here such as gender and age, education etc so in the data sheet i have to identify how many values how many items so i'm just counting so how many items are there one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten so i have to write ten over here after this press ok okay minimize this output window again so in this sheet i can see the probability value and you have to click on probability value increase the decimal places to five and then copy this probability cell open the actual sheet escape first row and first column copy all these probability values over here then again go on your spss sheet select the serial number cell you have to select the serial number cell because you know that the serial number cell have a uh, few items that are not present such as respondent number four is not there respondent number eight and nine is also not there so you have to copy this cell from the spss sheet so a copy here this is serial number this is probability so just select the cell of probability conditional formatting highlight cells less than 0 0.001 is considered as multivariate outliers so i just select the values i just select the values and now focusing any value that is considered as yes but this value appeared as red this is respondent number 104 so what i have to do is come again in the data sheet identify respondent number 104 
Respondent number 104 is here. Select this row and then clear it. Again, come in the Excel sheet and search for other multivariate outliers. Respondent number 130. Here it is. You can see that the SPSS serial number shows 125. So please do not consider the SP the serial number. You have to consider this serial number which you made in the data sheet. You clear it again. Again, sorry for the 161 and 166 and so on. You have to detect all the items till you are this 161. This after clearing all the values, save this sheet for further analysis. That's it. Assume that I have considered, uh, I have deleted all the univariate outliers. After this, you have to save this sheet. This is your final data for further analysis. Thank you so much.